My name is Matt, but you can call me Absol. This is my journey to collect all of the new Alolan Pokemon in Sun and Moon. Gotta catch them all, Lola. Let's see where this journey takes us. I hope you enjoy. Arceus, the Alpha Pokemon. This is an incredibly powerful mythical Pokemon that can change types when given certain kinds of plates. The Aether Foundation in Alola wanted to artificially recreate this system with an artificial Pokemon. This was in an attempt to create a Pokemon known as the Beast Killer that would be able to kill Ultra Beasts. They successfully got the type switching to work and created three prototype artificial Pokemon that they called Type Full. But the experiment failed and they cryogenically froze them forever. Until now. Now my goal is to not only obtain one of these Pokemon, but to also obtain it in its shiny form. It kind of makes no sense to me why this thing is available in its shiny form with all the other shiny locks that were put on Pokemon in Sun and Moon. Especially when considering how unlikely it is that the Aether Foundation would make three of these and make one of them a different color for some reason. But oh well. We're gonna hunt for a shiny type Noel. Let's go. Shiny type null! Shiny type null! Yes! After exactly 1400 soft resets. Bruh. Okay, so you, as you can see, um, normal one on the left, shiny on the right. Fantastic. Dude. Yes! It's hard to tell the difference between Dude, those, like, like the so tail and stuff. Hard. Yeah, it's like the X, the tail, and that's about it. And the, the uh, headdress thing. The headdress, yeah. But the tail is the most obvious part. And a lot of people have soft reset over this thing. Well, I know, I've seen the videos. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, man. This is Diogo. This little turd monkey got no before me. You didn't even get to know yet. <laughs> I didn't get to know yet, but this freaking <laughs> freaking Wimpod has been a jerk. Yeah, he's still hunting Wimpod. Sorry, was motivated by me not getting it for the longest time to start hunting <clears throat> hunting for it himself. Well, my guess is adamant. All right, so let's check out the shiny decks for this thing. I'm gonna close my Sun version. This is on my Moon. This Moon version is very lucky, aside from the Wimpod hunt. Uh, it still hasn't found anything since then, until now. And here is the shiny decks. Very cool. I'm not gonna nickname it yet, but I'll nickname it after the video and you'll see it whenever I'm using it as a heel blocker on uh, Tapu Fini with its final nickname. And now we get the memory drives as well. I actually haven't seen this bit of dialogue before because I've just been soft resetting beforehand. Cool to know that Gladion got some closure on his story with that. Going to save real quick to make sure everything is good. All right, we have that one nature guess from Dialga when he saw this. Um, I'm going to guess mild, and it's calm. Interesting. It's, it's a calm little guy. I don't think that's too amazing of a nature for it, but I'm happy because it's a shiny, and we'll definitely like use its purpose in catching that. Tapu Fini, whenever that, oh, we get the chance for that. I'm kind of at a loss for words right now. I was, I was just kind of like chilling, shiny hunting, not really expecting to get it tonight, but just you doing that while I was watching the Games Done Quick Marathon, which is going on right now. Just watched a really good uh, speed run of Pokemon Emerald, 
And that one just ended right before I got this. So let's like switch off of this Delmize. Oh, it looks so cool whenever you're in Refresh in the Ether Foundation. That whole background is super neat. This is such a cool Pokemon. And here it is in battle. Gorgeous. It's such a good shiny. Now in order for this type null to reach its full potential, we need to evolve it. And in order to evolve it, we have to use something very powerful. The power of friendship. This was a lot harder than I thought it would be because I learned something interesting about Type Null that it shares its base friendship value with Baneri and most legendaries where it starts out at zero friendship and it has to get up to 220 in order to evolve. And there are lots of different ways to increase that number but when it goes from zero to 220 it's still going to take a while even with the Sooth Bell. But I managed to pull through with the power of friendship and evolve it. That looks so cool. I dig it. Alright, let's check out the shiny decks for this. Shiny Silvalli, or Silvalli, or Silvali, however you pronounce it. I'm pretty sure it's Silvalli. That looks awesome. What's up? <laughs> kind of looks strange from the front like this, but it's super cool. But what a cool Pokemon. Definitely a great Pokemon to have as a shiny. Alright, now that I have my shiny Silvalli, I'm going to level it up quite a bit and teach it Heal Block. And then next time, I'm going to try and capture Tapu Fini in a Beast Ball. I'll see you then.